here in DGC TV we have for you today the high class about the multimeters in Unity and this is the DSO digital storage oscilloscope the UT2102 2102 that is a 100 megahertz 500 ms per second digital storage oscilloscope we're going to see all the differences also and the different models that you can see in the in the 2000 series and some news about the 4000 then we are going to turn it on then we turn it on and we can see here we can turn on the two channels we can position them independently one and two with different color we can put them independently and we can test in each one so here we have the channel one and the channel two we can select which channel we are going to use then we have here the channels the bolts here we have the space for the BNC's and the props we're going to give this this 2102 that is a 100 megahertz DSO comes with these two props manual your guarantee card with your serial number your USB cable your connector for any country and here we see all the functions we have the control for the trigger the horizontal and vertical positions the two channels channel 1 channel 2 and the functions for each channel we, ca we have uh, self adjusting storage saving and load your storage and we have the different positions to do and to measure here these uh, device can add can subtract can multiply can divide can reverse and FFT can connect uh, to a PC and you can make extended analysis in the PC you can see here the scales in volts and in second and nanoseconds this is going to be um, this is the UT2102C you see because it's in color in Unity in the 2000 series you are going to have the B series that are the uh, white and black and the C series that are all the colors and this screen here is a uh, in a is a 5.7 inches 145 millimeters in the diagonal and uh, is a 64k full color display 320 times 240 is the resolution this uh, is a 100 megahertz bandwidth the rise time for this is going to be 3.5 nanoseconds the sample rate in real time is going to be 1 s per second in 500 milliseconds and second and um, it's going to be the record maximum is going to be one megabyte the channels are going to be in real time 500 ms per second and the characteristics of those channels that is the equivalent to 25 gs per s and uh, the trigger type that we have here the trigger type is going to be edge pulse video and alternate so those are the trigger types you have in here as we see here we try to see here you have the different functions for each channel 
device subtract for the mat FFT now we're going to turn the mat off we're going to turn the reference on then we turn the reference off and now we have the channel 2 here and the different we can invert the channels you can as I we you can position the channels with here or also you can give a better position the trigger also we can level the trigger to a position we want if we want to make a comparison between the channels then we can you see there we can move the trigger up and down to do a minimum or maximum limits between the two channels we can choose also the display we want uh, X and Y or we want GL then we can choose here which kind of display we want to use we want to use vectors or dots then we can choose that too in the kind of display in the utilities we have sales adjustment and auto adjustment we have languages here so we can use it in English or in Chinese if you are Chinese and you are in other country and um, this multimeter usually applications for this that is a very portable one I mean the 3000 series is a heavier one is like for having in the workshop or if you are making something to test and qualify something to install computers or repair TVs then the 3000 is a more heavy weight but this is a full portable it's not even 3 kilo this without packing of course it's not even 3 kilo and you can do training with them you can have it in the university for the students this is just uh, this is just 32 centimeters 320 millimeters 320 millimeters here 32 centimeters is 15 centimeters tall 150 millimeters and is in deep is just 130 13 centimeters in here so it's really really portable and then you see it totally on the tail here in the DC you have your USB connector here and you saw it here in the GCTV news about the series 4000 from December or January maybe because we have the 4000 like announced since April in the Digicom fair and we saw it in video and everything but it's ready it's ready for December or January all the ones that have asked us about the 4000 series the new high development for advanced electronic and this in an installation is going to be ready for December so to conclude the 2000 series we have from 25 megahertz to 200 megahertz so you have uh, the because you say ah there are so many of the 2000 series but yes we have from 20 megahertz to 200 megahertz so you just need to request or get the ones for your needs your manual your warranty your probes your USB cable your your power cord that's it two channels 100 megahertz 500 ms per second here in DGC TV